About 11 o'clock in the morning in uh, back home. Um, today was a, a rougher day. It was one of those days where I woke up just kind of not feeling, kind of felt a little off today. Um, and I think a lot of it is just that uh, this is the longest I've been away from Chrissy. And I've now realized that it's another 11 days before I get to see her. Um, and just uh, not sitting too well with that right now. Um, did have, luckily, the chance to, uh, to internet chat with her back and forth a little bit this morning, which was comforting, but also made me a little bit more homesick. So um, while I'm having a blast and looking forward to the next 11 days, I'm also looking forward to getting home um, and, and being back with my family and with her, uh, definitely. So it was another exciting day, though. Um, it started off with a, a plane ride to Mahongsan, which is in the northern part of Thailand. Um, it was intriguing because we got to the airport and I realized at that point that it was a small plane, a 12 passenger Cessna plane, um, and I don't like flying. So um, it was a new experience for me. We, we crammed in to the little plane um, and, and took off. And fortunately, it was, um, God blessed us, took care of us. It was a very good ride. It was about 45 minutes. Had to go through a couple different rain showers, which were a little unnerving, um, but all in all, um, was really cool. It was the best view uh, of just the landscape that we've had the entire time because the plane flies lower. Um, and this is just beautiful, beautiful country. When we came down as we were landing, we, uh, we came through the clouds and there was a, a big rainbow on the ground, um, which was awesome to see. So we have some video clips from that that we'll get up there for everybody to see. When we landed and got out of the plane, it was like walking into a sauna. Um, hot and humid, um, much more so than I was really looking forward to. Um, so that has changed the experience altogether here today because um, it is m much hotter and much more humid where we're at now. Um, we got to the hotel. We, we, we got here and uh, had about 15 minutes or so to get ready to go out to do our next activity. Um, the hotel is very nice. Um, it, it's amazing. All the places we've stayed have been really nice, um, but not expensive at all. I think just all the places in Thailand are nice. Um, that I've seen so far. But we went out um, to a Buddhist temple up on the top of another mountain, um, handed out tracks to all the monks there um, and some of the visitors that were there, and uh, took some pictures of just the, the landscape. You could see the mountains there fairly well. Mahong Sun is surrounded by mountains, and it is a very remote part of Thailand. It's about a five hour drive to go from uh, Bangkok to here. It's about a, um, a 45 minute flight from. Uh, from Chiang Mai where we were. So it's much faster to fly than to drive. So we flew to, uh, to save time. Um, but we have some cool pictures we'll put up for you to see. But it was neat to see a lot of the monks were actually reading the tracks. And uh, we hope that that seed being planted um, can be something that God uses moving forward. Um, we also went to a, a hot spring that they have here, um, handed out tracks to all the people working there, um, had a chance to see some of the stuff they do there. And we put some mud on our faces which was kind of gross, kind of smelled like pickle for some reason, and I hate pickles, so um, we washed that off as quickly as we could. Um, and, and then we went to dinner, because uh, it was late in the afternoon we got here from the plane ride. Um, dinner was really nice. Um, we had some, some good Thai food. You can hear the, the noise behind me in the lobby. Um, but we had some good Thai food, Thai food as all the food has been so far. Charles and Lourdes have done a good job of, of, of ordering for us in some cases and making sure that we really experience the food, but that we also get stuff that they know that we can handle, which has been um, a true blessing because um, there are some days my stomach just doesn't feel so hot, probably after the fish snacks. Um, and I've heard there's a request to eat those live, so I will do that when we get back to Bangkok. Another snack that uh, seems to be pretty popular is um, chili squid flavored potato chips. So maybe I'll get on here and try some of those um, in a couple days when we get back in Bangkok as well. Um, but after dinner, we headed out to a, a small um, church that they're trying to start here in, in Kamrai, or I'm sorry, in Mahong Sun. There is no church here yet. Um, they started about a year and a half, two years ago, trying to plant a church, and they have a few people that come um, to that church now. But part of that is that they, they have an, an English as a second language class that they teach there. And, um, they met tonight, so we went out to meet with that group, um, and, and that was... Literally the most most amazing thing I've been to so far in this entire trip. Um, they gave us the hour, hour and a half to spend just leading that group. And um, again, Buck sang some songs. We have some great video of, of the kids there. And it was almost, I would say, 80% kids um, singing. 
um, both in English and in Thai, which is really cool. And they're singing, um, they're singing Bible songs, um, which was, was really moving. It was really cool to see. Brian got up and, and preached um, just an amazing sermon. God really spoke through him. And uh, of the, I'd say there's about 40 people, 35 people that were there. There were, uh, there were 14 professions of faith, which was uh, really cool to see God God do. Um, you know, at, at church back home, I've never seen 14 people all at the same time uh, make that commitment. To see 14 out of a group of just, just 35 was, uh, was really, really awesome. You know, God is really working here in Thailand. He's really um, is using the homes, his ministry, and other people that are here, and, and fortunately using us so far to uh, really reach out to people. So there was a request that we come back there tomorrow. Brian is going to preach again to another group of people that are there at their praying, prayer meeting. So um, really praying that he moves, um, that God moves again through that opportunity to reach more people. But uh, I tell you what, it, it, it's, it was very emotional, um, for me at least, to, to see that many people you know, in, in that sermon. And, and God really worked through Brian in an amazing way. So today has been a blessing. Um, Looking forward to another day tomorrow. We're going to have to do um, some tree planting tomorrow at the, the, the church that they're planting here. Um, and uh, spending the day teaching some kids um, some, some English for about an hour and then tree planting all day. And then uh, Brian will be preaching again in the afternoon uh, or in the evening at their prayer meeting. So um, another good day in Thailand, another great opportunity to, to reach out to people. Um, and and I, I was just floored by this evening, so I don't even really know what else to say. But... Uh, I hope everybody back home is doing well. We are doing great here. Um, God has definitely washed out for us and is, uh, is definitely using us and growing us. I know that um, I am a different person than I was seven days when I showed up here, and I can't imagine how the next 11 days are going to be. So um, we love everybody.